shall we call for the truth? The, the idea of what um, Tavares was saying about uh, it's always about you. You know, someone in, uh, is calling your phone, someone is after you, and you block them. You're blocking you. You know, don't block you. Just, you know, don't answer if you don't feel like answering. One of the best gems I had in my personal experience was the feeling of people enslaving me. I used to always say like, damn, why everybody tr trying to control me, man? Like, in my love life, work life, my friends, you know, my family, like everybody. And it was like, it got to the point where the realization came, that's you. Like, why are you, there's something in you that's permitting this. There's something in you that is speaking and broadcasting that this dynamic. Yes. So change something. And I'm telling you, when I changed it, it all changed. And it's the same for all of us. When I changed uh, from worshiping the person I was with to being more in respect of myself, my life changed too. Once I decided I'm doing what's right and best for me, I hope that what you want to do is right and best for us because I'm on, this is the path I'm on of elevation of self. Once I did that, everything else fell away. But until I did, it was I was living a very painful emotional existence. Every time someone thought something or did something or I thought they should do something or they owed me something, that was very painful. When I realized I was responsible for myself and if I wanted it, I could get it and I was capable of it, there was no more conflict. You know, the rest of it is more like this bad behavior in the periphery. You know, it's not really in front of me anymore. It's over there somewhere. I see it, but I'm not engaged in it. And I think that's the big point for all of us is to recognize if you give someone, and we recognize that people are misbehaving, and we give them all the power of all their great misbehavior, we lose. Silence is consent. Join us in speaking up. Like, share, comment, subscribe.